Hi everyone and welcome. In this video, we have a couple of things that we need to do to that CentOS virtual machine that we created in a previous lab. You can see that I've already got my remote desktop session into my uh, infrastructure slash Jumpbox VM. I've already got a session open into ESXi. Here is my CentOS 1 VM. I'm going to open the console for this. And I'm going to log on. Now, the first thing we need to do is install VMware tools, which is something that's pretty important. Um, that will allow ESXi to communicate with the VM and understand what the VM is doing and vice versa. So for that, we have a pretty simple command. And that was pretty quick, didn't take very long. The other thing we're going to do while we're here, because we're going to need it, is we're going to install Perl as well. And that's it for that part. The other thing that we need to do is we need to upload that CPU busy file onto this VM. And for that, I'm going to close out of here. I'm going to minimize this window and we're going to use WinSCP. So we'll launch that. And I'm going to connect into the IP address for that Linux VM. So we'll log in. It's going to ask us if we're going to trust the self-signed certificate, which we will say, yes, we will. And what we'll do over on the source side is I am going to navigate, uh, instead of my documents, to my desktop. Here is the CPU busy file. And over on this side, I am in the root directory, meaning the home directory of the root user. So I'm just going to take this guy and copy it over here. Tell it, yes, I want to do that. And we're all good. Uh, one thing I will do um, while I'm over here is I'm going to select this guy and bring up its properties. And I'm going to modify this so that we can execute um, the file. The reason I'm going to do that is because that's actually a script. And if we did not set execute, then that would give us problems later on. So I'm just kind of taking care of that now. Say OK. That's all we need to do. And we can close out the session. And we're good. That's a wrap for the video. Hopefully this is helpful for you. And we'll see you next time.